All right, everyone, this is Hayden, the Master Healer, and happy holidays to everyone. And um, I just want everybody to, I just want to say thank you for all the new subscribers. I see you guys, and um, thanks for the love and support. And don't forget to go and click on the new, um, the December blog is out. Go to the spiritualfixer.com, um, click on predictions. You see all my latest predictions for December and beyond. Don't forget that. Don't forget to go to the spiritualfixer.com. Click on your free gift. Everybody, um, you can subscribe, get your free gift. I appreciate all the love and support. And um, this reading here is with Laurie um, Harvey and Michael B. Jordan um, for, for 2022 and beyond. Um, let's see if this relationship is going to survive for 2022. Do we see marriage? Do we see a baby? Um, what's ahead? So you guys will be um, hearing um, all the juicy stuff. And also moving forward, I'm not going to be doing updates and reading. I just want to read in celebrities once a year now. I don't have the time and the energy right now because um, I'm, I'm more focused, more um, on healing people, more doing more spiritual work and getting people lives turned around. I know you guys like the little celebrity, you'll get that. But I'm not doing celebrity celebrities all the time and doing updates and stuff. It's more teaching, more um, showing you guys a lot of things um, about in the spiritual world and, and, and hope that we can... Um, you guys can learn a lot from me not just celebrity these celebrities don't care nothing about you me none of you guys um so so let me just dive in quick up and, and let you know what's up so definitely for laurie harvey and michael b jordan as i say for laurie right now i'm seeing her making a move i see her moving like in a big home i see definitely a new home for um for laurie harvey and um i see new vehicles and stuff for the new year um i see that she, that michael and her will end up moving in together I see that um, for 2022. Also, I see that with Lori Harvey, she have to watch her health. I see that um, that she can end up coming down with something mild. It could be um, she have to be careful um, with COVID. Um, I hope she taking care of herself. She have to watch her health um, properly. But I see that she will come down with some type of mild sickness, but she'll be okay. So definitely, I hope that um, that they're paying attention because they all watch all these readings. They all watch it, you know. So. Um, they study what we think sometimes, but um, I'm not here, no hating. I love um, Michael and Laurie, but as I say, I stand by everything that I say in my readings because you guys know I'm being consistent with my predictions. I don't make up stuff here. This is what I see, and I, when I journey, I write it down, um, everything here, so I'm just going over what it is I see. Um, also for Laurie, I see that when, um, the, the, the Miss Universe um, with, with the hosting was a good look for her. I told you guys back in, in 2021, and I told you this um, relationship here with Michael and Laurie Harvey, this was a good look. I, I told you guys the parents, Steve especially, was trying to polish up um, Laurie image. As I say, it was to get away from them rappers and all that stuff because heading down that path with the rappers because it was not a good look for her. Um, Steve really, really loved his daughter, uh, Marjorie, and, and them, they really loved the child and they wanted the best for her they didn't want to see her going down that rabbit hole and um people trashing her and all that stuff you know what i'm saying because at the end of the day that's somebody child and somebody daughter and um somebody sister and brother at the end of the day and um i do like them together but as i say i have to um see what it is i see and you know it's not about me um so definitely um after the miss universe pageant and hosting for um for laurie um i see that she'll be networking um making a lot of contacts with people in foreign I see eventually she'll be um, traveling to uh, in foreign countries and stuff, networking, trying to expand our, our business empire. Um, because definitely I see that um, um, with Steve um, taking her, he's make, make, he's like a, a mentor. He's making sure that he, um, coaching her. I see a lot of people around her advising Laurie and stuff, and she's listening. She's very focused now. A lot of things that you guys see in the past, this time now she's all about her money. She's about expanding her brand. And I see a lot of great, great things for her when coming to money and stuff. You know, she'll be okay. Um, also, too, when she's traveling abroad, um, abroad, she have to focus um, what she, um, who is making her food. She have to be careful what she was she eating, what she was she drinking, um, because anything could be put in a drink, anything like that. But I know she will have security and things like that. But she still have to be careful who's preparing her food whether it's here in the states or whether abroad be careful she have to watch what she's eating all right also to i see for lori also to um she's human just like anybody else young um beautiful lady she have her own securities or her own um her own insecurities just like anybody else 
but she needs to um, focus on, on her concentration. I see sometimes that she's have lack of concentration. Um, that's what I see. Sometimes she could feel a little sadness sometimes when she by herself. She's human, you know, I mean, she will go through the same things um, like any other young person. Sometimes, you know, she try not to read some of the blogs and, and some of the negative comments people might say about her. But um, but other than that, I see that she'll be okay. Um, when coming to Michael, I see for, um, for Michael B. Jordan, um, as much as uh, things are looking great for him, you have to be careful of, of being getting sabot um, sabotage and in his career um, because he's on the right path. Um, as I say, he's already, right now, he's on the level of the superstar and um, he's heading in the right direction. Uh, he's directing his own movies and stuff. But also, too, you have to be careful. I see a lot of jealousy and envy for him in Hollywood. Not every skin teeth, not everybody's skinning and laughing at you. Um, really want the best for you at the end of the day. So he have to um, double check stuff. He have to triple check stuff because, as I say, a lot of people would not want to see this young man be very um, successful in the near future. So you have to be careful and double check stuff and watch who you trust in in Hollywood when coming to Michael. Um, I see um, also for Lori a lot of a um, lot of deals um, right through because of her father and stuff. Um, because of Steve, I see a lot of um, future deals for, um, for, for, um, for Lori in the near future, especially this year, heading into 2022. And things will, will be looking good for her. So um, definitely, um, as I say, I don't see anything wrong with her father helping out his daughter. I believe in that. I believe in nepotism. I don't care what nobody say. I think people, um, well, I think black people sometimes study too much what people might think about a father being successful helping a child or helping um thing but you look at you see with donald trump you see he helping his kids he have no shame in the game and black people need to, to stop having shame and studying some people trying to shame oh that's your father no you need to, your turn is your empire you need to have your business and your family your sister your auntie i believe in that i believe in nepotism hands down and black people need to stop with that nonsense. You understand what I'm saying? Stop trying to put pressure. We always, no, because of your daddy. No, stop that. Uh, every other race does it. Everybody does it. You understand what I'm saying? All them other celebrities have the trend acting now. Um, and nobody doesn't be saying anything. Okay? So, definitely, I, I believe in that. Um, I see um, I see that um, our engagement, I said that a couple months ago. In one of my blogs um that i see engagement from um, from michael and and, and, and laurie and um i see that um definitely that it will be get close enough to want to have um, a, a wedding but i see some type of engagement it could happen maybe for a birthday coming up in january or maybe um for valentine's look out for that um i hope that it happened but i see definitely some type of engagement and they will want to get married but i see that um I see that that definitely um, with Michael, you have to be careful um, with, with certain things because, uh, as I say with him, I see that um, I see a betrayal in one of these here in this relationship will betray the other one, and I stand by that. I see that this relationship it doesn't matter whether they get a, whether they get married or what it is, one of them will end up um, cheating and and the other. And that is going to cause the breakdown in this um, relationship at some point in time. I'm not going to give a time. I'm not going to give a date. Because a lot of times with these celebrities, they study what we think and what we say a lot of times. So sometimes they want to prove us wrong. So what is we doing? You're pretending like if they're still together and sometimes they already break up. I told you guys a lot of times, that is why I doesn't like to give updates. Because sometimes some of these celebrities will try to make us look crazy in the streets. Because they hate whenever we are right and when we predicting stuff. So I'm much wiser moving forward. A lot of things I'm not going to say. I'm not going to give no special time. But as I say it doesn't matter with this relationship. One of these people here, Laurie, between Laurie and Michael, will end up betraying. One of them will betray each other. I'm not going to say who. I know who it is. But I'm not going to say who it is. You understand what I'm saying? You guys going to see it's going to reveal itself when the time comes. Um, you see, all my predictions been happening. I, I told you guys about a lot of relationships that's not going to happen. You see that with Common. You see that with, um, with Common and, and, and Tiffany. You see Common admit, I see Common admit last week that he said that he, he was at fault. I told you guys that he is the problem. Um, Common was the problem in Tiffany Harding's relationship. Um, I stand by that and, and you see it happen. Um, also with this relationship with Laurie and, um, and Michael, 
Um, other than that, for now, things will be good for them. But this is what I see that will cause, I mean, eventually will cause a breakup. One of them will betray each other. And um, that's all I have to say moving forward. And that's it for, um, for 2022 for Laurie, Harvey, and Michael B. Jordan. I wish them all the best. I hope that it don't happen. But this is what I see. And this is what I I I I, I gonna say. So, but other than that, um, yeah, um, that that's it for 2022. So it's a quick um reading for 2022 for them. I wish uh, Michael and them all the best. I hope it don't happen. But um, sometimes temptations um come, and a lot of wolves in sheep clothing come around. People are gonna be tempted. Sometimes people will be put in certain um situations. Um, I do like Laurie and Michael. But as I say, long term, I don't see as a good match. But as I say, this is what I'm seeing for 2022. I'm not going to give no time and date when it's going to happen. And I don't wish anything bad in anyone. So I just, I hope that I'm wrong. And um, But um, this is what I'm seeing and this is what I have to say. So peace, love and blessings. Like, subscribe, share. Please um, don't forget to get your free gift, thespiritualfixer.com. Um, click on the notification bell. And you guys look out for um, for Porsche and Simon. Look out for a lot of um, celebrity readings. Look out for a lot of teaching videos for 2022. And thank you for all the new subscribers. I love you guys. And um, you'll be hearing more from me soon. Bye. So peace out. Bye.